Hi, this is Mike from MonkeyPod, and in this video I'm going to show you how to manage all of your grant proposals. Uh, in order to do that, we're going to use a tool called the Grant Tracker. Uh, in MonkeyPod, you'll find that under your main menu. Uh, it'll be listed under MonkeyPod Apps, and you'll see it down here, Grant Tracker. If you don't have that app already installed, you can just click on the Explore App Marketplace and, uh, and go over and install that. Uh, but let's go into the Grant Tracker and see what it looks like. This is uh, kind of your one-stop one shop, your command center for man uh, managing all of your different proposals and all the documentation. So you can see which proposals have been rejected, awarded, anything that's been submitted or in pre-submission. You can see the titles of each um, uh, grant that you're applying or you're submitting and, um, and the funders, the award amounts, the ask amounts, and the deadlines. Uh, if you click on the Visualize tab, you can see uh, your success rate by proposals or also by your, uh, the financials in terms of the total opportunities won or pending or, or not awarded. And you can even see uh, your deadlines roadmap in terms of action items uh, across the year grouped by month. Okay, let's walk through what it looks like to actually submit a new proposal. Um, we're going to create a new proposal. We're going to say we're going to apply to the MacArthur Foundation. And let's say that our program is going to be our Leadership in Journalism program. And we'll say that we're going to ask for $30,000. And here's where we could uh, include any instructions. Maybe we want to say that the proposal must be submitted via online portal. And we could include a link to the website uh, where that needs to be submitted. Next, we're going to identify uh, and log all the documents that need to be included in this proposal. Uh, so we may have a letter of inquiry, a proposal, the budget, the financial statements. Maybe we also have an appendices section that we need to have uh, some specific information in there. Um, we can also uh, drop in a, a link here to a Dropbox or a Google Drive folder, any kind of external uh, place for, for document management in terms of actually writing and, and constructing those documents uh, so everyone knows where those documents live and, and uh, you don't have to go through a, a gatekeeper for them. Next, we're gonna set our deadlines. Uh, this is where we can assign the work to different people and set internal and external deadlines. So in this case, I may have uh, Frank actually handing the uh, responsible for the letter of inquiry, but uh, maybe Elaine is the one who's actually gonna write it. Um, and that might be due, let's say, um, April 8th that's coming up. Um, and our proposal is, uh, uh, Frank's going to be responsible for it, but Jamar is going to be the one that's actually writing on it. Um, and that's going to be maybe due uh, August 1st. But we're going to set an internal deadline for July, maybe a couple of weeks uh, before that. Uh, so we want to take a look at all that documentation ahead of time. So we can set the, the rest of the deadlines for uh, all our other documentation the same way. Uh, we can assign it to different people, um, and I'll just click through here for all of these documents and set the deadlines. And lastly, our appendices. Okay. Once we have all our deadlines and our, our kind of work assigned, we click All Set. And now the Grant Tracker app uh, shows us that this is uh, proposal is in pre-submission. Uh, we can see all the deadlines here and the, and the documents. We see our proposal notes. If we need to change anything, we can do that. If we click over to the proposal document section, this tab here. Now we can see all of our different um, uh, uh, documents listed out uh, and kind of what we're working on over time. So I can leave comments. I can tag different members of my team. Uh, I can adjust the details, right? I can change due dates. I can mark priority as high or low. Um, and I can even leave comments in here, maybe... Uh, Rich, um, please review uh, this letter uh, before our ED signs off on it, right? Um, and now we'll have uh, a comment here that'll tag Rich in MonkeyPod and also kick out a notification to him. So once we have all of our, our documents and we're, we're done with everything, uh, we can mark that maybe this proposal has actually been submitted. Once we do that, MonkeyPod says, great, nice. Uh, now we're just going to wait to hear from the MacArthur Foundation in terms of whether it's been awarded or not. So I can hit close. Uh, if I go back to the grant tracker, kind of our main menu there, 
you can see that our MacArthur Foundation Leadership and Journalism Program, it's been submitted. Uh, let's say MacArthur comes back and says, it's great, it's been funded. Uh, we, we've got, we've been awarded the grant. We can then change this over to awarded. Uh, MonkeyPod will say, great, there's a, a couple of next steps that we need to do to make sure that, that we're uh, uh, kind of closing the loop on all these items. And MonkeyPod is now going to prompt you to record uh, this grant award on your books. So you can do that by just saying, click on record now. And we can say that this was our leadership and journalism program for $30,000. Uh, the date that it was awarded on, you can select a different date for when it's actually payable, when the, the check or the uh, uh, online transfer is going to come through. You can also uh, choose whether this is a restricted uh, funding grant or a general operating support. In this case, let's say it's for restricted uh, funding. By, by logging that now in MonkeyPod on the accounting side, We've now created uh, an account in our chart of accounts under net assets as a restricted net asset account for specifically for that grant. So MonkeyPod has done that automatically for you. Um, in this case, you can also then log any post-award documentation that you may need to, to put in, like interim reports, uh, thank you uh, letters, your final report, uh, and you can set internal and external deadlines just like we did with the pre-submission documentation. So. Uh, that's been a quick look at the Grant Tracker app, how to manage all of your grant proposals in MonkeyPod. Uh, thanks so much for watching.